We're here at the Japan Mobility Show, David Chow Automotive Press. We're hey here guys. with a special vehicle. It's, it's actually one of a kind. This, there's no other prototypes from Afila. Afila is Honda, Sony working together, Honda, Sony Mobility. And uh, what we have here is a very interesting car. A lot of questions we have. We had some answers we'll be able to give you today. Uh, David, what are your initial thoughts? Well, you know, there's lots of electric car manufacturers trying to do the same thing. But Sony is trying to differentiate by having some of the latest and the most advanced software. They're saying yeah. this is not just electric car, but basically software on wheels. And they're doing something that no one else is doing, such as a media bar right here, that's sending messages, mm -hmm. multiple uh, infotainment system inside. Mm -hmm. And you know what? It is going to really cater to some of the new generation of future electric yeah. car buyers who wants all the tech. But I'm yeah. not sure about the name. What do you think of the name? I think of shoes. I think of the Fila brand. A Fila, it's still, it's going to take some time to sink in. I like how it looks. I think the brand, like, oh, it's gone now. But <laughs> because typically cars logos don't move out of the way. Yes. Um, but how it looks visually, it's very symmetrical um, and it is recognizable. Yes. And that's, you know, at least as a brand, it's not going to be a forgettable brand name. The fact that we're talking about it is right. good pu publicity, right? Yes, Whether yeah. we like the name or not, it's, exactly. it's, it's uh, good for the recognition of the name. Now, in case you didn't know, it's A and then feel and A. So we have two uh, letter A's, but really they wanted to focus on the word feel, but they want this to be emotional car. Now, I, I feel a little bit of a 1990s retro vibe to this. Yeah. Those people, for those people who actually remember the Subaru SVX, had kind of this design. At the time, that SVX was considered to be a really futuristic uh, car, very rare car. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if that was had any, any kind of influence, but it's very smooth, like a smoothed out pebble and like a riverbed. That's kind of what I'm thinking. It's very smooth. And, and here, uh, Kirk, look, I can't even measure the gap. But there's no gap. There's one single there's piece no. for the hood. One piece. It comes all the way here, and so the gap is just only here. Mm -hmm. uh, and even the wheel wells are body colored as well. So right. you have this well, very uniform. I, I like that. The wheel arches are, are body colored. Almost every vehicle we've seen out here at the Japan Mobility Show has a, black, a glossy black surround at the bottom of the car, around the wheel arches, around the bumper. The bumper doesn't have any of that. In fact, you just see the active shutters right there at the bottom. Uh, that is going to help with aerodynamics and improve the range, which we can't talk about range. We can't talk about power numbers. We don't have those numbers. We don't know they those don't, numbers. They, they haven't given us that. Yeah. But here's an interesting take. You know, I'm the guy who measures gaps and look for the body lines. And we saw recently Lexus concept car with lots of edgy uh, lines. Look at this. There's Com de it's devoid of all lines. Completely yeah. opposite. Smooth, no. smooth. Smooth. smooth, nothing, yeah. no lines whatsoever, all the way through. Exactly. So you what know, a unique design. Afila said that they, they didn't want the design on the exterior to be necessarily the showcase. They wanted to make it very uh, smooth, nothing really sticking out, because they wanted the focus actually to be on the inside with the technology and the software. So should we, let's keep, let's walk yeah, down to the walking. back. I feel like, I feel like I'm calling it like an egg, egg shape or cocoon shape, you know, like one long capsule, like it a, does, like a, maybe it's supposed to represent uh, organism, like a living it, organism it, in it, a cocoon. Right. It does look very premium, and I have I actually like it a lot better than the more busy uh, concepts that we've seen at the show. I agree. It's, yeah. it's very pleasing. Clean it's design. not making me angry or energetic. It's just kind of calming. If we listen to, uh, you know, it's almost like water and wind chimes going in in this weird parabolic container for the vehicle. It's, it's a really good ambiance to match the, the exterior so design of it. It is a five door hatchback design. You can see it goes from here all the way to here. This will pop up this way. A clean design for the back again. A little bit of lines, a little bit like uh, what we see in the Hyundai Ionic 5. Yeah. But other than that, once again, clean, clean, clean with not much of a lines. The closest thing I've seen to this is uh, maybe some of the Ionic products. From, from Hyundai, but this is on another level. Everything just looks yeah. very, very uh, smooth. And I think this is also another media bar it here, is, yeah. right? So this strip right here, you can send send messages or, you know, Well, we know, we know the Japanese well. culture, even though this won't be built in Japan, at least not initially, this will be built in America and exported to Japan. We know all the cute little Hello Kitty stuff that they could bake into here and customize the experience if they wanted to. The thing is, is it legal? 
uh, for depends That's on the true. country you're in and, and what laws you have. But look at this, it'll tell you like your charge rate yeah. and it has a nice animation to it as yeah. well. Well, in Vancouver, where we get a lot of people tailgating us, I'm going to put a message that do not tailgate me or back <laughs> off. Back <laughs> off. Yeah. I don't know. Again, that might not yeah, be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we should take a look inside. So I don't know if we're actually we, we're allowed to sit are inside. Are we able to sit on the inside? Okay. Can so, I open uh, the, the front passenger? Yes. Okay. Uh, David, yeah, go I'll ahead and get I'll on hop the inside. in here. You hop in the other side. And uh, let me close the door if you want to. Sure. Right, so we Thank can you. keep okay, open. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay to adjust the seat? I think it is okay. Oh, I can adjust the seat. You can yeah. actually adjust the seat in here. Yeah, I can adjust the seat in here. Oh, this is, you know what? Like it's it like nice um, when you buy expensive Sony uh, electronics or uh, Yeah, like a speaker system. cover right here. Yeah, which exactly. Is, That's is what, probably speakers? what it is. Is this like a speaker cover? Are, we gonna are there, ask sp are there speakers person? in here? Um, speakers we have in here. Oh, up here. Oh, this is just the material, right? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, I see. But it's the same material uh, you would have over a speaker cover uh, here. Shoshu, shoshu kokanare desu. Shoshu. Oh, it has a, a yeah, deodorant, yeah. or like a fragrance. Oh, yes, I can yes. smell it. Okay. Yes, it has fragrance built in. So as we, the speakers we have in here, mm, and also okay. on the neck part as well. This is oh, okay, so there's speakers, yes. active speakers in the oh, in the headrest, the neck as well. the neck rest, yeah. You have a full Alcantara, Alcantara yeah. material. Really well made. I mean, for a concept car, yep, this thing digital is rear view mirror. Now, really well made. When, it, Sony has expertise in so many things. We think mm -hmm. video games, that's why you have a, a PlayStation controller in here, and you'll be able to stream PlayStation games, watch your Sony movies like Spider-Man in here. Um, but what Sony's also known for is not necessarily entertainment, but also cameras and sensors. Yes. And we have over yep. 40 sensors in here. Um, so they're going to be helping Honda reach new levels of autonomy and safety that we've never seen. And on top of the car, there's even a LiDAR sensor. Right. Yeah, yeah. So I have a Sony A7 camera that some, I sometimes use, but uh, I really like Sony electronics, period. Mm -hmm. I mean, ever since I was growing up as a kid, we had Sony Walkman and everything else. It's almost like an idol yeah. brand for us who grew up in Japan. They're very expensive, very premium. Uh, but they have a great reputation of great products. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so I do agree some of these uh, trims. The colors and the feel has a Sony look and feel to it. We have how many panels? One, two, I mean, three. I, I think three panels. I think this, uh, is, this is one big one. Yeah, that might this be... This is one big screen. This is its mm. own screen for the digital side mirrors. Yeah, they might have combined two together with a line yeah, in between a, somewhere. But anyway, yeah. it looks like uh, one continuous uh, screen. This is the camera. This is a rear view camera. That's the rear view camera. Over here? Yeah, it's on yeah, the door. Which yep. is still illegal in mm -hmm. North America, so we won't get that. <laughs> okay. um, but this is actually quite small. I'm surprised yeah. how small this one is. Oh, it's okay. It's, it's actually fun functional. Yeah, um, yeah We yeah. also have your drive select here. They're actually knobs. So you would twist, twist this. I'm not going to do it. But actually, you would push it down uh, into drive, push it up into reverse. You have auto brake hold here. You have parking brake on the far right side. I actually like that. I like those yeah, stocks. Yeah, actually, it I like the good. stock. Let me see. I don't, oh, this doesn't open. This isn't open. It's yeah. squeaking because I'm pushing, putting my oh, weight on you know it. You can move this. Oh, it, it moves. Oh, you can move the center yeah. console here. We see that in Genesis it, products. Yeah, it, Genesis have it yeah, too. Yeah, the GV60, I think, has something like that. Some you know what? We have too. a rotary dial. Oh, this is a... <gasps> oh, that's David, a volume David, control. David, 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 David. <laughs> Here's the thing. Put your hand on that and move it. And tell oh, me yeah? what you think. Oh yeah, it's got a nice, nice oh. tactile feel. Buttery with the and clicky. Indentation feel. Oh, so like, man. like something out of a very expensive stereo system. Yes. You know, when you open, oh, that's a nice feel. That is the best feeling that's a nice knob feel. in a car wow. for a long time. And I bet it has a multifunctional purpose. So right now it's a volume. Right. You probably can change it. You can change it. I'm not going to do that right yeah, now. Yeah, I'm not going to. I don't uh, touch these buttons. Yeah, but something's going to go wrong. Look how clean that is. This looks like a PlayStation much. controller with the yeah, symmetry oh yeah. and the small it buttons. Light, it lights here. up underneath too. Look at that. The light. Yeah, up. see, it looks like a plate. You have four buttons there, right? But this is actual PlayStation control, right? Yeah, it's the exact same that's a thing. PS5 controller, <clears throat> yeah. But are we controlling a game or are we controlling something else to do with the cars? We should ask that. So this is a remote play for uh, PlayStation 5. Yeah, so if you have PS5 so, at home. Yeah, then connected to the mm -hmm. internet, through the cloud, you can yep. play here. Yeah, this will of course be connected 5G for whatever, the fastest internet. Right, exactly. Um, and that would be a, a potential revenue source for I them too. I guess so, that's true. Because you have all these subscriptions here, but if you have that internet subscription as well, so you can tap into this endless amount of uh, Sony media too. And I suppose at some point, if the autonomous technology oh becomes God. really good, 
you could maybe ta have the computer <laughs> AI take over the driving while you play the game. I don't know how look, legal that I mean, will look be. Look how responsive this is. Oh, and yeah, this car won't come yeah. out for, okay, well, I'm, you know, internet issues, but. You might I, get in trouble I, for doing this, but we're I'm doing so, it anyway. we're, we're years away from this car being out. This could be a production car. Well, it is going to be. They're not going to change much to this car. Right. So yeah. what you see here, I would say is going to be 95% the same for the production model. So the big question, of course, is, you know, things like pricing, you know, we don't have, have any kind of value oriented uh, information. So we have no idea what, what positioning it is. So it's hard to figure out because so many electric cars are coming out. Yeah. I think, like you said, Kirk is unique in a sense. It has a lot more focus on software and technology, catering to those people who grew up with PS5s and they want to carry that tradition of not of playing yeah. games but inside a car right I they're think. beating they're beating apple to it because you know we grow up with, with these products we're familiar with these products we become identified with these products right yeah like, yeah i'm an apple guy i buy apple macbook i buy the headphones i buy the phone the if there's an apple car they would do well but sony's like no apple we're going to do our best to team up with our partner here in japan yes honda and we're going to do it better than anyone um right. should we get in the back seat sure let's take a look yeah, so instead of close the door, by the way. Yeah, so it's like it's, it's like an Apple car except Sony version, Sony car. So, but it is in collaboration with Honda. Ah, oh, sorry, no more. Mukou makerai run desu ka? Okay, he's gonna open the other side as well. Will that be uh, a, uh, in the production model, auto opening doors? Yeah. Yes, it was planning to. Oh, wow! By using those cameras. Oh, the camera. Okay, that's a big deal. I, that I, is I mean, really neat. Oh. So you'd want to stay like four feet, four, four feet away from the car until it'll recognize you from yes. here? Yes. Okay, and then it'll open the door. I didn't know that. Did you know that? I had no idea. That's a big deal. Fully electric door open. The only one that we know is the, the Genesis G90, right? Oh, this is comfortable. <laughs> oh. We've been walking you know around all day. I'm ready yeah, to relax. Me too. I'm going to sleep, man. Um, you know, I, my head is hitting this bar back here. You can see that. Oh, yeah. But the back end is a little vertical. Like, it's the lumbar support is not super oh, good. I'm We're getting super picky here. But yeah, it's, it's personal yeah? preference. I yeah, feel like preference. if I wasn't for my head running into the back here, I would be out to go take a nap. So maybe I'll just slump <laughs> down a bit. Yeah, maybe. But I, nice. it does look like, uh, I, I suppose, obviously, te maybe they're targeting Tesla customer because there's a bit of a Tesla look here with a light colored uh, leather or something. It's probably not it's leather. Minimal. Yeah. It's probably like a synthetic leather. But, but again, that, that same oh, speaker yeah. grill speaker cover. Here. Yeah, yeah, that's I here, that. here, here. This is the Alcantara full, full uh, glass roof. But more camera here, though. Is that light or camera? That's probably a camera. Oh, uh, no, that looks like a light to me. Is it a light? It looks like it a looks light. Like there but is, it could uh, be, yeah. if it is a camera, it'd be there well, for safe, safety some, purposes. It, yeah. God willing, you don't leave your kid in your car, but yeah, that's that, true. it would probably gonna, alert you. I'm going to ask this, this guy. I don't know if I'm not trying to <laughs> wave, wave to <laughs> yeah, him like I'm ordering a, a food. Server, but yeah. This is what this is? This is camera? This is light. This is light. Oh, okay, uh, just a street light. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Straight, straightforward light. All yeah, right. Yeah, I just okay. blinded okay. myself. I guess spots. And we have the same um, kind of a. Uh, These are big. This looks like tablet. a fourteen-inch tablet here. It's not functional. Uh, but yeah, it is yeah. on. It yeah. looks really high definition, very crisp. Yeah, definitely. And yeah. Sony makes some of their own displays too. They have, they they're do. very well known they for do. TVs. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so and and That's used cool. to laptops in America. I used to love it. Sony laptop. I used to buy like yeah. all my the laptops Vio. were Vio laptops. Yeah. I love those. I don't know why. It's like a Vio there. on wheels, kind yeah, of. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, um, but like you said, it's pretty good room. It does sit a, a little bit low. Great room, I guess. Uh, I mean, glass roof is bit, pretty yeah, standard. Glass roof. So, I get. I, I mean, knowing knowing that there's quite a bit of luxury features here, I think it's not going to be cheap. Down. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, nice armrest. I mean, these kind of stuff, Honda will be involved, right? Designing the seats, you know, contour of the seats, how I mean, the door opens. I I'm mean, worried. Honda's a car I'm almost company. a little worried for Honda, the Honda EVs. I bet the, yeah. but it's still a Honda at the same time, so it's a yeah. weird situation. I know. I, yeah. It's hard to believe that they decide to yeah. collaborate together. I mean, I mean, Honda is also collaborating with GM, so I don't, I don't know. That must be yeah. a new strategy, right? Well, a new strategy uh, this morning was announced that Honda and GM are not going to be working together for uh, after this initial batch of oh, vehicles. Oh, okay, okay, interesting. Yeah. Okay, so, I'm not too surprised by anyway, that. Yeah, but. I think most people would rather a Honda work with Sony than Honda yeah. work with General Motors. Yeah, of course. I'll see you guys down below in the comments about that. All right. Is there a trunk? Let's see if there's see a trunk. Let's see if we can open the trunk or not. 
Yeah. Trunk will get out of this. Trunk will get out of this. You can't open the trunk. Can't open the trunk. But you know, you know, if you look at from this angle, it's got a Porsche 911 vibe. Yes, it does. It wraps around a little bit more than a Porsche, but yeah. Or actually, the Porsche Taycan has that look to it. So that's cool. Yeah. So it might be plain and simple, but it caters to a certain market. And like you said, if people grew up loving Sony products or they love Sony products right now, whether it's a camera or a game console or TV, it will do really well. I, I think, especially in Asia, where Sony brand is really, really, really um, respected, they yeah. probably would like it. And also just the sheer um, cool value, right? Yeah. Hey, I have a Sony electric car. How cool is that? You can you can do Sony your whole house. Now you can do it with your car. <laughs> That's true. It's, That's so it's cool. really neat. Yeah, we'll have to wait and see what the pricing is and the range and all that. But I suppose that's the part that my Honda might be working. So whatever Honda has, it will probably mirror a similar type of technology for electric car powertrain. But we'll find out very soon. We'll shortly. find out. Yeah, 2020, early 2026 is when we'll see this vehicle. It's 100% coming. This is actually, out of all the vehicles that we see at the all the concept vehicles. This is one we know without a shadow of doubt. It's coming almost identically to what we see this car today, which is really, really exciting. The future is here. It's going to happen very soon. Let us know in the comments below what you think. But we're going to sign off for now. Bye. Peace out. Afila.